The Senate Judiciary Committee held a hearing on addressing America's gun violence epidemic yesterday, during which Republican Senator John Kennedy of Louisiana asked a witness whether Chicago's gun laws led to its high shooting rates. Well, why don't you cry about it? Hello and welcome back. Thanks for watching. Yesterday, during gun violence hearings, Republican Senator John Kennedy roasted one of the Democrats' anti-gun witnesses. And at one point, there was a very informative and entertaining exchange that resulted in Kennedy exposing a liar. What came next was an ignorant and unhinged meltdown over at MSNBC, leading to them spreading disinformation that I'm happy to easily debunk. All of that right after we quickly talk about the fact that our economy continues to spiral viral, albeit at a slightly slower rate. But wouldn't you feel much better knowing that your retirement and assets were secure? Check out how precious metals can help do that and get a free coin while you're at it. Dark clouds are gathering as markets shudder. Stocks are sinking. Currencies stumbling. Fear and uncertainty reign. The Middle East, Ukraine, Taiwan, the debt, it's endless. Yet one asset stands firm gold. In crisis after crisis, gold is there in the background. Its enduring value guards against lost, like a missile shield against incoming. While paper wealth burns, gold persists. Listen to me right now. Shield your savings against looming threats, war, recession, contagion, and avoid the frenzied panic of the unprepared. Fortune favors decisive action, so get a hold of gold now before it's out of reach. Right now, Noble Gold Investments offers a free 5-ounce America the Beautiful coin with every new IRA. Claim your free coin today to secure your financial future. As this new storm gathers, panic looms, and some of those places that you were thinking of for your money well, they're not looking so clever anymore. Secure your future against disaster. Open a Noble Gold Investments IRA and claim your free bullion coin today. Go to noblegoldinvestments.com now. That's noblegoldinvestments.com, the only gold company I trust. And remember, there's always risk of investment and there are no guarantees of any kind. The Senate Judiciary Committee held a hearing on addressing America's gun violence epidemic yesterday, during which Republican Senator John Kennedy of Louisiana asked a witness whether Chicago's gun laws led to its high shooting rates. No, 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 no not that. He is or here is the ensuing exchange with the Dean of Yale School of Public Health, who is also an ER doctor. Well, la de frickin' da! That Chicago has become America's largest outdoor shooting range. Do you think it's because of Chicago citizens uh, who have no criminal record, but, but who have a uh, awfully a gun in their home for protection? Or do you think it's because of a finite group of criminals who have rap sheets as long as King Kong's arm? Gee, let me think. So Mississippi, Louisiana, and Missouri actually have higher firearm death rates. Um, obviously, there's certain... What about Chicago? So I don't live in Chicago. It's not my primary area of research. Convenient. Oh, really? Well, you're also not from Missouri, Mississippi, or Louisiana, but you had no problem commenting on those. I'm also very suspicious of the claims she just made and how she said it, but we'll come back to that when it's most humorous. You don't have an opinion on that? I think there's easy access to firearms compared with, combined with environmental conditions, uh, lack of great education. There have actually been studies showing that when you green vacant lots and repair abandoned buildings in urban neighborhoods, you see decreases in gunshots, in violence, as well as in stress and depression in the neighborhoods around them. Uh, what? No disrespect, Doc, but that sounds a lot like word salad to me. You want to talk about word salad. It's given racism, Mika. That was racist? Of course! Ah, uh, yes. The old, everything I don't like and don't want to hear is racist strategy. It's a bold strategy, Cotton. Let's see if it pays off for him. Elitist, so condescending. And ill-informed. Ill-informed and insulting. Let's talk about the numbers the doctor was referring to. Ah, I can't believe this man. It's so, it's repulsive, actually what he just did, what we just showed you. I see in his- Racism. Is he in this room right now?
Wow, are you kidding me right now? What did he do exactly besides dismiss the obvious deflective babble from the activist witness? What she said was a word salad because she was being intentionally misleading with the words she used. This hearing is about gun violence and Senator Kennedy is talking about gang warfare in Chicago. Gang violence that's very prevalent and is usually done with illegal guns. The point being, gun laws don't matter to criminals. The gun laws in Chicago are very strict. In fact, they're number seven in the country for gun laws. Her response was that these other three Republican states with more lax gun laws were actually worse than Chicago, stating that there were more gun deaths. So Mississippi, Louisiana, and Missouri actually have higher firearm death rates. <laughs> Yeah, it's pretty obvious that she did this because as you can see here, Mississippi's gun homicide rate is around 13 murders per 100,000 people. Louisiana's rate is around 15 murders per 100,000 people. And Missouri's is around 11 murders per 100,000 people. Chicago's gun homicide rate is around 29 murders per 100,000 people. And yes, I did put links to the data for these stats in the description so you can check it out for yourself. In other words, the gun deaths she's talking about are accidental and suicide which is more than misleading in a hearing about gun violence. And it's also very telling that she said she couldn't speak to Chicago because she didn't live there. Yet, she doesn't live in any of those other states either. Wild. All right, folks, that's all I have for that one. Thanks for watching. And if you're still here, you might as well hit that like button and leave a comment to help the channel. Thanks a lot.